A good nonstick frying pan is a must in the kitchen. A frying pan can be made of any heat conductive metal, in this case, aluminum alloy ingots. They melt the ingots. A robotic ladle scoops up molten aluminum to be used for casting. They use this two-part die to transform liquid aluminum into a frying pan. The robotic ladle pours the aluminum into the die through a cylindrical port. This high-pressure casting produces a very precise shape. After about a minute, an operator takes it out. They cut off the excess using a computerized tool. The table moves as the tool cuts the edge of the pan to specifications. A worker sands the edges and rounds the rim of the pan a little more. They cast pans in several sizes and thicknesses. Next, they put the pans in a sandblasting chamber. Next, the pans receive their ceramic coating. Each pan spins on a pod as a plasma flame melts three different powders onto it. An employee scrubs each pan with an abrasive pad to remove the residue. They prepare up to five proprietary coating formulations for each frying pan model. Each one contains dozens of chemicals and thousands of tiny diamond particles. The diamonds increase durability and heat conductivity. They also make food less likely to stick to the surface of the pan. They spray the different coatings onto the surface. The spinning ensures even coverage as the coatings adhere to the hot pans. Now a primer is applied. It allows the final nonstick coating to bond to the frying pan. Then the frying pans go through a furnace to bake the coatings onto the pans. Once the pans have cooled, a robot transfers them to a lathe. The lathe spins the pan as a tool shaves off a thin layer of aluminum. This leaves a clean level surface on the bottom of the pan. A suctioning robot moves the frying pan to the next station, where a worker attaches a handle to the pan. Thousands of nonstick frying pans are ready to leave the factory and cook up a tasty meal. <laughs>